Yo, what is up YouTube? My name is Aaron and today I've got planned for this video two things. One, a Q&A that we'll get to later. Talk about you guys leaving me questions down below. And the main topic of this video is Black Ops 3 Zombies. Uh, do I like it? How is it? And I'm going to try to compare that to other games. So first off, I want to talk about Gumball Machines. I like them. Very useful. I know they had to add it to spice it up, but I don't want them and that sounds really bad that's kind of like your grandparents are like oh get off your phone use a calculator for your homework but this is a calculator no you need two devices like i feel old whenever i say that like i don't want the gumball machine stop innovating but it's zombies zombies used to be something that would just not scare you you know you didn't want to crawl up under the bed but it was creepy you know what i mean it was just it was a nice gritty zombie experience and it was kind of scary and I feel like the last map that captured that was Alcatraz and Black Ops 2 or Mob of the Dead and they just haven't brought that here yet but this map is pretty close it gets you thinking it's really it's a cool idea that they have here that you're in a castle castles are creepy it's snowy it's kind of dark outside panzers come out really creepy really like that that's why I really do like this map Shadows of Evil on the other hand not so much. It's, you know, it was just a city and it was rainy and there was margwas and, you know, it just, it was what it was. It was very bright and colorful. And although this map is very bright and colorful too, and they have to make those colors pop because it's next gen, I just, I miss the days where it was just easier. You know what I mean? It was just, it was a zombies game. You get the weapon out of the box, you get the wonder weapon out of the box, and you're ready. That's the setup, and that's what's going to bring me into the next topic of this, the setups. I really, really hate setting up on Black Ops 3, and they tried to introduce this into Black Ops 2, and they succeeded with Origins, and there's some other maps that you do need to set up on. I'm not saying this is the only one, uh, Shadows of Evil on this map, but definitely I hate setups, and I, I know I'm not the only person that hates setups, so I'm not going to on that for a while and a setup just so you guys know if you're unclear what I'm talking about with a setup what I mean exactly is you go and you have to kill all the uh, you have to feed the dragon souls right then you get the bow right then you have to upgrade the bow yeah and then you got to play and that seems like oh that that's just a few steps but in reality that's either rounds or time it's either you know, Shadows of Evil, I haven't really timed it for this map, haven't played it that much, but Shadows of Evil on solo, my best time of setting up was 45 minutes. That's crazy. I don't like that. I want to just play, you know, I want to get something out of the box and go, and that's what Black Ops 3 is staying away from. They want you to work those early rounds, and I don't like that, but it's not my call. I'm curious to see what you guys think down below, so let me know your thoughts you know there's tons of other stuff i could talk about in black ops 3 amazing other than the gumballs like they got some stuff right for a change you know it's really fun i really do enjoy it but i do want to know what you guys think down below but don't quit the video yet don't close out of that let's talk about that q a i promise so here in about a week or so actually not even a week probably over this weekend if i get enough questions or even monday or something like that you know something close I'm going to be doing a Q&A, and I need your help by asking me some questions down below. So, before I leave it with just ask a question, ask some questions that are good, that you really want to know. Nothing nothing too dumb that's just going to get thrown out and not answered. So, if you want your question answered, make sure it's a good one. Make sure it's, like, something that you would want to be asked. You know, like, a question that's just been burning your soul for a while I, I don't know come up with something and ask me down below i'm gonna do my best to answer as many as i can in one video i'm not gonna be like that person that gets a million questions and picks five that's not cool if i let me just tell you what kind of person i am. if i get a million questions nowhere close you know like a couple thousand i would make however many videos it took to answer as many of those as possible like you can't answer every single one but I wouldn't just let all your questions go to waste, so keep that in mind whenever you're asking questions. Just make sure it's nothing dumb. I, I don't know. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this gameplay. Panzer Shrek kills us every single time. Peace.